So I, I, if I were back in the day writing a Christmas letter, it'd probably be, Dear Father Christmas, this is actually a true story, this actually happened. I said, Dear Father Christmas, I hope you're having a good day. Um, I just want to make sure that you're looking after your sleigh and it, it doesn't get scratched because that's a bad image. And I was like 10 and it was so dark and I sent it off. And you know, I, I, I hope, I hope he, he kind of sort that out. Sincerely me. Aww. <laughs> I actually don't ever remember writing a Christmas letter, but I think wow. what I'd end up doing is going, Dear Father Christmas, and then just sending him pages of the Argos catalogue. <laughs> and I circled everything that I wanted, <laughs> and then I would just sign that off. <laughs> Sincerely me. <laughs> Here's my Argos so pages. Sweet. So lazy. What the hell? <laughs> Lazy or genius? Because I knew genius. exactly it's what I wanted. Genius. It's genius. I take it back. It's genius. Okay. Genius. Christmas traditions. We would just do the classics of we'd leave a carrot, a mince pie, and a glass of yes, milk all at those the bottom things. of the yes, chimney. Yes, 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 yes. And my dad would put soot footprints through the no, house. He and yes, he would. No, he wouldn't. It was Father Christmas. Oh, it was Father Christmas. Every time. <laughs> Oh, and I always get um, makeup wipes in my stocking. <laughs> Not as a child, but now the stocking equals essentials. Right. Although actually I don't have makeup wipes anymore because yeah. I'm trying to save the environment. Favourite Christmas movie. We were all talking about this backstage in the dressing area the other day and we picked our top five. Five? Oh, top five, and it was really, really hard. And I, I didn't have a top, but it would have to be between Elf, mm. just because it always makes me laugh. Mm. And do you know what? I really like Arthur Christmas. Oh, no, it's The classic. cartoon. It's lovely. Yeah, I love Arthur Animation. Christmas. It's not a cartoon, it's an animation. Sorry. <laughs> it's probably Klaus on Netflix, if you've seen Klaus. Um, that's oh, amazing. That's Honestly, amazing. watch Klaus on Netflix. Like, I'm, they, I'm not getting paid for this, trust me. Um, that it is Klaus, it's, um, not Claus. No, it's Klaus. Klaus. And that's how you know. You think it's Claus, and then it's actually Klaus because okay. you watch it. Done, done, done. Uh, then Elf and Home Alone. Between those three. I've never seen Home Alone. Stop this. <laughs> I've never seen it. I've seen pictures of it. <laughs> Please, next question. I, oh, I do love love, 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 actually. That's a classic. Probably the best Christmas present I ever got when I was, I was probably about 10, 9 maybe. And there was a trampoline outside in the garden. Like it was, and I didn't know, like they must have done it when I was in bed. Um, you know, built it all up and stuff. And Aww. I literally just wept and wept. And I learned how to do back flips, front flips. Then over lockdown, we got rid of it. And I said, I'm going to have to do the thing I always wanted to do, which is jump over the fence. <laughs> Into the hour, like backspace that we have behind our house, and then I like yeah. How did that my, go? Fractured my wrist really badly. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's fine. Oh no, <laughs> we're fine. I no. think just being with family, to be honest, is no. is present enough for me. Oh, it's, oh, it's yeah. true. <laughs> There's something else magical about Christmas, and that's Sam's jumper. Well, Hang on, actually... we need to move the mic. Just look dead into the camera. Don't even smile. No, we can't smile. This is gonna go on forever, so you can just cut whenever. Are you smiling? Stop smiling. Oh, <laughs> I can't not. <laughs> <laughs> it's just gonna keep going. Thank you, thank okay. you. <laughs>